I have a little trick to share with you today on your outdoor images when you have a lot of greenery. Um, you know how you see those images that kind of have that deeper look to them, you know, like their grass doesn't look lime green in the pictures, like they look nice and warmer, darker, earthier. I can't I don't know how to explain it, but I want to show you how I took this image and I went from this to this. That's the video coming up right now. So I absolutely love working in that last hour of sunlight. You know, the sun is nice and low, the colors of the sun. Um, if you have clear skies or, you know, the sun's colors are going to be warmer tones, more orange, more pinks, like whatever, whatever happens. It's just going to be way more flattering to your client rather than when the sun is right above you, everybody's squinty, things are blasting white. It's like, don't do that to yourself or to your clients. So last hour of sunlight, go outside and have some fun. Um, so let me show you this Capture One trick, which you can also do in Lightroom. Um, go into the computer here. What I want you to do is go to your color space over here. Go to Color Editor. You can go to Basic. Click on Green. And the first thing I want you to do is desaturate a pinch. Okay? Like five or so. Immediately that calms down how much green is throwing at your face, you know. But take your lightness and watch. Bring it all the way out. See how that's crazy dark? It only affects everything green in the image. So if your client is wearing green, uh, this may be a small problem. But uh, I do not have that issue with this image. So coming back up, it's like, where do I want my, how do I want my grass to look? You know, I don't want this. I don't want it all flaring and blown out like that. I really want to calm it down tone it down and my subject is more highlighted than the rest so the only other thing brighter than them in this image is the sky so that being said let's go back up to your exposure let's go down to your high dynamic range let's go to highlight let's turn down your highlights again now we've got blues Yep, then we got blues in the sky that is complimenting her dress. And then last but not least, if you wanted to make this a preset that you can just click on your outside images, like let me just get there. You know, presets are not perfect, but to get there, all I would normally do is click on this guy right here. And then where it says styles and presets, click on the little three dots, save custom style, okay? Say yes, all those things are turned on. Hit save, name it. All right, I called mine GK Dark Green. Hit save, it's gonna be in your styles folder. Okay, now I already did that. So right down here where it says dark green foliage, that's what I did earlier. Okay, bam, you just created your own preset. I'm gonna walk you through the exact same steps I just did, okay? I go to my glossy sharp. I turn that on, booyah, I'm going to go to my exposure, I'm going to turn it down a pinch, there you go, now I'm looking at these greens over here, okay, so if you did not make a preset, let's just do it from scratch again, go back to your three circles, come to your color editor, to basic, go to your green, desaturate a pinch, and let's take your lightness, and how dark is too dark, you know? Because you can always just come right back up. But it's like, eh, you know, I'm not really worried about how the background is blowing the greens in my face over here. So let's go down to point 30. Call it a day. Isn't that neat? So look, I hope this helps you today. These are the kind of things that I'm doing with my images, like all the time when I'm working on client files, you know? And I'm all about working smarter, not harder. So knowing something as simple like this, that you can even make your own preset, just call it darker green foliage or whatever you want to call it. Um, it'll, it'll, it'll save you, you know? I find it makes your images more uh, of an earthier, warmer tone. And I like how those greens in the grass and your trees are not that crazy lime green 
screaming at your face. You know what I mean? So, alright you guys, if you like this video, do me a favor. I'm a very small channel, okay? Hit that uh, like button. It does help the videos get algorithm grasp. And, uh, you know, please subscribe if you want to see some more of these. I have a lot more coming to you. But uh, most importantly, I want you to stay focused on your dreams. Because that's what we're doing here on the channel. Alright? Peace. Peace.